All right, so what I'm working on now is I got a few scraps of cedar from a project I did last year. And I just want to kind of get a better feel for the planer now that I understand it. Um, I got some variants, very varying size pieces. Um, this one, half inch, less than a quarter inch, uh, quarter inch, and greater than a quarter inch. And those are what I'm hoping to finish too. So like for example, on this one, I measured my thinnest spot. It appeared to be one half inch. So I'm anticipating being able to plane it down to one half inch. This one here was just under a quarter of an inch. So I anticipate being able to plane it down to about that thickness there. So same thing with the others. Um, I'm just gonna really just monkey around and get a feel for the machine. So I got the pieces all laid out, pretty much the same orientation as before they went through. Um, the half inch obviously did came out the nicest. It looks uh, looks really good. Um, still got some thickness to work with there, you know. Little spot there that it just didn't get. It must have been less than a half inch, but um, you know, once it gets down to about a quarter inch, it it gets uh, iffy, and by that I mean I had these uh, pieces with uh, eyes in them from, you know, limbs or whatever, and 
in the quarter inch piece they did okay but as it got more ornate and thinner it just shattered it right out so maybe i could have done it with thinner passes but i was already going pretty thin i was i think it's just uh it's such a violent vibration cutting them that it it shakes those pieces up and then they just get sheared out but looks really nice the I can make a couple little projects out of two of the pieces, maybe three. So we'll see. We'll add them to the collection. Mm -hmm.